What's going on guys, today we're going to show you how to set up Super Mario 64 split screen multiplayer because I, I looked in the comments of Kay's Emanuel's video here and people have problems like some people know how to set up because they're smart but some people are still having issues and I'm hopefully going to show you guys how to resolve most of them in this video but first I'll show you how to like actually get the ROM working. So Kaze has a download on his release video here. Download the patch. Now you're probably like, it's a patch, what do I do with that? You go and go to this link as well, which is a patcher. And make sure you have Project 64 and your own Mario 64 ROM. First of all, you want to download split screen multiplayer patch. It shouldn't take that long, so yeah. See, it just took me seconds. It will download down here. Now what you want to do is go to the patcher site that case is linked. You want to go to ROM. And then go and find your Mario 64 ROM. Now it has to be the Z64 format. It cannot be N64 or anything like that. It has to be Z64. And make sure it's a clean Mario 64 ROM, so an original ROM. You want to open that. And then you want to find the patch that you just downloaded. And then you can save it as anything you want. So I'm going to save this as Super Mario 64 split screen multiplayer. I'm not really sure what this box does, but you want to click patch. Now as you can see we now have a ROM down here. We can now op open Project 64 and make sure it's the latest version. For me it's 2.3.2.202. Go to open ROM. And select split screen multiplayer. It might take a while to load but here it is. Mario. Hello. Now as you can see everything's working all fine, you can go and select the file, and boom, we got Mario here and we have Luigi on the bottom, but how do you make it so you can control Luigi as well with a second player? Well I'll show you that just in a minute, but if you're getting a black screen or anything like that, you want to click settings when you have the ROM open you don't just click it when you when you open project 64 and then you should see this down here make sure this is at 8 megabytes and then make sure this is at 1 to reduce lag hit apply and ok